Hello everyone, my name is Sam and welcome to Civil Gamers. This is the Dark IP server. Yesterday I reviewed the City IP server. Um, and yeah, I'll, I'll compare the two and I'll give you an overall score at the end of the video. The download time to get in was uh, a little quicker than the City IP one. Uh, I think about 5-6 five, five minutes, 5-6 five, minutes, not too bad. However, when I joined I experienced so much lag. I've rejoined really the this server a few times because it restarted um, and it lagged a lot on the start and sometimes throughout the game too like I was halfway through recording the server's been up for a while and the game would just break down uh, I think it's because of the cars I don't believe uh, downtown's good for uh, cars however this is like I think the biggest version of downtown so it is slightly justified but cars make so much lag and and yeah, there was just a lot of them. The heads up display as you can see here, a lot nicer than the uh, previous one in City RP. Uh, it's, it's more custom and there's everything you need to know there, so the commands are all there. And yeah, that's really good. And also, a lot of jobs, uh, a good amount. There's uh, donated jobs, but there's not an overwhelming amount of them. So yeah uh, there's a lot of things to do in this server it is a really fun server I think so far from all the reviews that I've done this is the, the game that I actually played the most on I, I got into it a bit too much um, but that's definitely a good thing as you can see on the screen I'm, I'm uh, playing around with a stack at all it takes me a while to figure out that you need to be a certain rank I believe to use stacker I disagree with that so much I think stacker's such a an essential kit to have. Uh, I don't know if it's just admins or you have to donate to use Stacker, but I think definitely if you're watching this, um, like uh, the owner uh, or dev, make make Stacker so anyone can use it. It makes bases so much easier to use. Again, like in the City IP, the money printers. I'm not going to go on about this too much because I mentioned it before, but I just don't like having to stay with your fan all the time uh, like making sure your fan's on your money printer because if you go and your money printer doesn't like have a fan it'll just blow up and I think that's unfair so if you've been in your base for five minutes and you're like you need to go it's a bit annoying knowing that your fan's going to run out soon but you don't know how long it's going to take till it runs out so you just end up sitting there for another ten minutes you know it's just an inconvenience and I, if there is something to be done about it I wish there would be now what you're looking at now is uh, a command button as I, I'm mayor now and I'm trying to demote someone and, and what I didn't like, it's just a small thing this but if it can be done I wish it would be and as I try to demote people there's, there's so many players in this server it takes me so long to find a player that I want to demote it's not, uh, so maybe putting in alphabetical call order for example if someone's called Sam myself I'd know straight away where, where they are because it'll be in the S section but in, not, in this it wasn't, it was just all over the place and it'd end up wasting time and if I needed to do it quickly because say if there was um, a cop that was IDMing I'd be there stood there trying to find his bloody name it, it, yeah if that can be changed then that would be, that'd be nice, it's only a small thing but something to consider. I did a few tests with admins uh, like just uh, typing RDM or something like that in the admin chat and I got zero response. I was sat there, stood there just for about 10 minutes, no not 10 minutes, 5 minutes and I just got nothing. I think I messaged 3 to 4 times and uh, later, like an hour later, I had this SWAT that I was a mayor with and I asked, I asked permission if I could kill him, you'll see that footage later and I kill him and then I asked him to message IDM and he got no response either, it was like 5 minutes and he got nothing and he kept saying RDM, RDM and he got no response so that is a shame. I, d I have seen a few admins flying around too I don't know what your admins policies are, I haven't looked into it but for me I don't appreciate seeing especially an admin that's not admin on duty seeing them just fly around because they can't be bothered to TP to people or they can't be bothered to make the run where they're in a, in a role play sense they just fly through the map I don't know names so I'm not, I'm not, I'm not here to get anyone demoted but uh, if, if you can try and control that a bit if you're uh, an admin or an owner just make sure for immersion purposes that your admins aren't just flying around 
something I was really impressed with that I haven't seen on a Garry's Mod server before, or at least not like this, was that the blood texture, if you get shot or someone dies around you, you know, the blood slowly swipes from the screen and you can hear the splatter too. And sometimes killing someone, shooting someone in the head, you, know, you see little brain bits. I didn't notice the brains until I was editing this video. I think that is a, a fantastic feature and for immersion and you know realistic vibes. Yeah, you know, you'll see it now. There you go. See that blood splatter and the little brains bouncing around. I think that is fantastic. And um, congrats to anyone. If if you coded that, well done. If you just if you just found it as a mod, still well done. It's a great feature, and I'm really happy you've got it. I didn't like how SWAT cat arrest. Like really. In a realistic world, like I, mean, I know it's really the police officer's priorities, but I think if a SWAT should I still have an arrest stick, um, they, you might have your own reasons for that, but for me as mayor, I just thought that was silly because, you know, police officers were around me, people were breaking the rules, I can't arrest them, so I would expect the SWAT to be able to do it. Just a preference that I think would make the uh, government slightly more efficient. I also don't like that you can only arrest someone if you've got an arrest warrant because I feel sometimes it's it, it promotes more killing and I'll explain this I feel for example the lockdown I did a lockdown and I was getting mad because like I was saying you will be arrested on the streets uh, but I don't know who's out on the streets unless I see them personally I'm not it's not my job as mayor to run around making sure everyone's in it's the it's the police um, but so they're going around and the only thing they can do to make sure they get inside is to is to, or to take them off the streets is to kill them and that's not logical if you if you can arrest them you can arrest them but they can't they need a warrant so for everyone they want to arrest which was a lot by the way I'd have to individually give them arrest warrants uh, so for that reason I just felt it was a bit unnecessary for the arrest warrants uh, I feel like if a police officer can, you know, need to arrest someone, you can just bat them. And if they abuse it, then they get dealt with. I understand that it, it, it prevents, uh, you know, arrest spam, but if you if the admins are on, you know, they, they should be able to deal with it, it shouldn't be a problem. The player base in this server is much bigger than City RP. It was, like, uncountable almost, which is a, a good and a bad thing. Good thing because it shows that your server's doing pretty well, but a bad thing because that's obviously there's going to be more minges but that shouldn't be a problem as long as you've got admins on but the, but it is a problem because when I was playing there wasn't many admins on and I even tested this for myself you know I've done two scenarios where I've we sat down and waited five minutes for someone to come and no one came um, I get obviously sometimes admins are busy but I felt if if the server's doing this well you, there needs to be more staff or at least more staff online you might have loads of stuff I just happened to not be online by the time I was recording this but if that's the case the owner or whoever's in charge needs to be like okay guys set times do be on this time be on this time. you should be messaging people like, like we've got so many people on we've only got like one admin online come on that's how it should be happened that's that's how it should be handled if it's a professional server and if this is what it, it definitely is otherwise it wouldn't be doing this well anyway that's my dark IP civil gamers review and to be honest, I preferred playing this much more than City RP. You know, people can get so much more involved. What lets it down a bit for me is that I didn't feel that there was enough admins on. I felt admins were better in the City RP. Um, I only played this game for two-ish hours, so you know, I don't take this so personally if I am saying this. I could be completely wrong, but from my personal experience, that's that's how it was. Anyway. I give City Happy a 7 out of 10, a good, a solid 7 out of 10, and I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10. I, th I, I thought this was done a bit better. If only admins were more persistent and online and more engaging. Uh, but other than that, yeah, it's a solid game mode. I actually had too much fun on it. I, I forgot I was even recording at one point. I, I recorded more than I wanted to, because that just means more editing, more time. But I honestly didn't didn't care because I was having that much fun the people were so nice I got some minges but that's that's what happens anyway guys thanks for watching if you could like that would motivate me and if you want to see more reviews just subscribe and hopefully you'll see those videos 
Uh, I'm just doing this to, to pass time uh, for fun. Right now I've got nothing going on, so you know, I can spit these reviews out, but later, sometimes you probably won't see one for a few days, sometimes maybe even a week. But we'll see. You know, I'm, uh, It's early days. Like if I'm doing this in a year's time, I'm sure this will be so much more different. But have a nice day. Hope you enjoyed watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.